how to attach photos to email on your iPhone. Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. I am Bimu from How to Geek, and in today's guide video, I will show you the way as to how you can go ahead and attach photos to your email on your iPhone. But before we get started with this video, if you are new to our channel, do make sure to leave a like, hit that subscribe button. Without any further ado or delay, let's get started with today's video. Now, first of all, if I go ahead and then open up the default mail application on my iPhone, and if I tap on the compose button from the bottom right let's say that I want to attach a photo to this particular mail but I want to attach them and insert them to the bottom of the screen not embed them into the mail of the body so which means that if I go ahead and a long press on it right over here you'll be able to see these options tap on this little arrow button all the way on the right hand side over here and you'll find other options such as insert photo or video or attach files if you want to attach something on iphone's mail you can only go ahead and attach a file but if you want to choose a photo it is going to be inserted in the body of the mail and not at the bottom of the screen where you want to send as attachment so let me just go ahead and also show you what this looks like if i tap on the insert photo or video button over here and if i select a random photo so as you can see it has been inserted into the body and not sent as an attachment which means that even if you go ahead and type something within this mail this image right over here is going to interfere so how do we go ahead and then attach and not really embed photos to email on your iphone the thing you want to understand is that we will not use the default mail application which is given to us by our iphone instead what we will do is we will go ahead and download the gmail application from the app store log into the gmail app you can also log into your icloud account your hotmail your outlook services or any of the other mailing services that your account is going to logged in and on our gmail what we will do is we'll go ahead and tap the compose button now over here what we will do is as you can see still we do not have the option so instead what we will do is we'll tap on the link icon which you see on the top right corner and over here again you could go ahead and then select a photo but as you can see the same old story it is going to be embedded into the middle of the screen but on the gmail app we can actually convert this into an attachment so in order to do that just keep holding on this particular photo and you'll enable other options such as speak and send as attachment and this is exactly what we want to do is if we want to convert this photo into an attachment and not embed them into the mail body so if i select send as attachment you can see it has been attached to the bottom of screen and it is not going to interfere with whatever i type in the main body of the email now there's also another way you can do this for example if i just go ahead and remove this when you select one photo it is going to be actually embedded by default but when you select multiple ones so let me just select one and the second one and then tap on the insert button it will be automatically set as an attachment in the gmail app however let's say that if you selected only a single photo so just as i did earlier you can go ahead and then tap on that single photo over here and then just tap on it and you'll find the option called send as attachment so just tap on it in order to send it though it is going to get the job done with the gmail application it will most likely help you but keep in mind that if you choose from the mailing application you will not be able to attach it it will only be embedded into the body of the mailing and this is how you can go ahead and attach photos to email on iphone we hope the video was really helpful and if it did help you make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you've got any more questions queries or doubts make sure to also leave them down thank you very much for watching and see you soon in our next video